very good afternoon my dear friends uh, today uh, we are going to discuss about what are the plan b opportunities for consultants and post graduates who are pursuing social and preventive medicine after mbbs degree so uh, this talk is uh, totally dedicated for them i always tell if you have a plan b options whatever the plan a you will not have a stress so nowadays the stress for earning has become more and the job insecurity even in medicine has come first time in the history especially in non clinical department even in a clinical urology department also the demand in a tier 1 cities are very less so this program is totally dedicated for all experts who dedicating their valuable time in investing and developing their brain and knowledge so they should not go with a plan a alone so there are a lot of plans beyond as a faculty in a particular department to earn after uh, acquiring a degree or after, after gathering a knowledge is important for everyone to survive is life without earning nobody can survive for survive everyone needs to earn but since there are uh, uh, the number of doctors are increasing especially in tamil nadu and karnataka this program is totally dedicated for all doctors so you can earn in a comfortable way and you won't have a stress of uh, uh, job security i request dr balaji arumugam professor of uh, uh, social and preventive medicine he is my beloved senior uh, to come into our uh, discussion i welcome uh, balaji sir thanks a lot <laughs> thanks a lot for inviting me sir. uh it's uh, so like it's a pleasure uh, balaji sir because uh, uh, i start exploring uh, the right person for the right place it is very important uh, to give a guidance a person like you is uh, the most important for anybody any uh, i can say the spm students to express about your uh, publication almost uh, 120 plus research papers chanceless brother 80 international international 80 publications 40 national publication best award best award in 2017 for tmch ijrula best research paper award oh my god in 2018 19 20 chanceless state treasurer of psm uh, more than 50 and national international paper presentations member of uh, education review amwg 15 years of teaching experience clinical practitioner too i know very well you have sent so many patients to me co-authored pg prep book yes you are one of the co-author of concept uh, book and uh, uh, this is a marvelous achievement uh, balaji sir there are no words to say your achievement as i still remember when you start your uh, um, uh, teaching activity in concept in 2009 2010 i still remember the word you uttered anton enakku or chance kudunga na class edukonu avladha enakku kaas nariya sambadichiten i want even that 10 years back itself your maturity in hearing is so high you are spread of knowledge is so high you always felt i have i'm seeing a person money is a by product i am a person i always tell money is a by product do something what you like whatever it comes is an outcome that word and maturity was there for you here uh, uh, 10 years back as a young uh, um, prof- assistant professor of uh, um, preventive and social medicine i am wholeheartedly welcome you sir and uh, this is my uh, utmost happiness uh, uh, to it's also the importance i am giving a person like you to come into the uh, social media the some person should ha- has to identify your uh, uh, passion your teaching interest till i remember i took preventive medicine because my professor used to tell yeah t- take a preventive medicine and enlighten knowledge because many of the time in those days we have seen people are not uh, energetic enough to guide the undergraduate student but i am really i am really seeing you as a most important person really you are your student bless welcome uh, professor 
of uh, preventive medicine dr balaji armugam sir please introduce about yourself sir thanks a lot sir thank you so much uh, dr anton i think i don't have to introduce about you you are a national level known uh, person soon you will become an internationally known person to many people also <laughs> Thank you. Thanks I, for your blessings and words, sir. It's very great feel to be associated uh, with uh, you, Dr. Anton. Uh, it's almost a ten years of uh, travel uh, as a friendship, as a brotherly hood feel uh, between you and me. It's very nice to. So you you have been remembering all those words which I have uttered long years back. It's so nice of uh, you to uh, me to uh, know all these things, sir. Very I'm very very happy. And at this uh, point of time, I would like to. thank her uh, my word of gratitude is towards our uh, uh, dr nellai paganesan sir he is my mentor guide who asked me to stay in md community medicine when i had a dilemma that also you are still remembering thank you so much for uh, recalling those things also it's so nice to i, I don't know how you are uh, recalling all these things it's that's the specialty of dr anton i guess so nice the reason sir. is so i, I like do it with passion her, uh, Passion is the reason, <laughs> Balaji. <laughs> thank you, thank you, Dr. Anton. So you have introduced about me already. Uh, nothing more from my side. Actually, you have uh, I've been uh, traveling in this uh, MB Community Medicine for almost 15 years. Let us this interactive uh, session. Uh, I will just uh, touch uh, my uh, field of interest. What all that I have been doing, and you know, uh, we have started our uh, PG coaching center with uh, some 20 to 30 people in the. Uh, exactly, sir. Exactly, sir. Exactly. So, exactly. So we started with blackboard, white chalk, and all these things. <laughs> I feel like we remember all these things, and the concept has grown up uh, to a national level uh, coaching center. I'm so happy about that also, and uh, blessings for and my wishes and blessings for the center and also to Anton and to your family too. Thank nice you, kids. thank you, thank you, Balaji sir. Thank you, sir. Uh, it's actually uh, Dr. Anton. Uh, I'm not going. To, it's actually it's not only the plan B. Actually, we are going to talk about plan B, C, D, E, F, G, H because we are going to have so much of plans in community medicine uh, because some community medicine post graduation it's an integrated subject. It's an integrated subject. So where uh, it integrates the many aspects of uh, public health, starting from biostatistics, epidemiology, health economics, laws, public health acts. health management techniques demography uh, maternal and child health care and also informatics basic informatics and uh, disease prevention uh, uh, pandemic prevention disease prevention gender inequalities and it also talks about especially the research methods of course all post graduates we have a thesis work and research methods are mandatory nowadays in almost all the universities recommended by uh, also by medical council of india but the very important speciality about community medicine is like in depth epidemiological aspects of research and as well as the biostatistics inculcating both uh, your uh, primary and secondary uh, research methods including systematic reviews and other specialties also which includes now occupational health uh, and uh, uh, environmental sanitation so this is a comprehensive very comprehensive subject of speciality uh, this speciality has to be understood first of all Uh, if a student or if an mbbs graduate uh, feels like taking an mb community medicine they should know that yes i am going to have or i am going to have a knowledge and competencies on all these aspects so with this introduction i just want to tell about um, basic things about community medicine yeah we can proceed with any questions from uh, sure sure balaji sir uh, like uh, now as i told you uh, in the in introduction uh, the uh, the number of specialists are increasing nowadays when uh, uh, 2000 the number of engineers uh, were more now uh, the number of doctors as such mbbs is more after 5 to 10 years now itself uh, there is uh, the demand for uh, uh, both clinical and non clinical department as a faculty is very less even in a government sector a urologist is being posted in a uh, gh side a urologist is a super specialty department yes sir. they mm -hmm. have been posted in a government hospital taluk hospital and the plastic surgeons are being posted in a government hospital and uh, like uh, um, in a, even in some of the primary health center also so this is not uh, uh, a place for a super specialist or a specialist to work so it's always see if i am uh, bursting a transplant i have to do in a, uh, as a transplant work 
so if i asked to do, do a conduct a opd uh, my energy my passion will not be fulfilled similarly non clinical department even if there is a clinical department they can practice outside but non clinical department basically they are teachers they should know lots because i am uh, we have seen uh, uh, last one year the number of young doctors being died by the myocardial infarct is so high especially in a government service we have seen 6 to 10 doctors nearly so uh, the same stress factor should not be happen because medicine is a profession where the settlement happens very late so that's the reason uh, this plan b program being developed by, it comes into my idea we should guide my dear uh, beloved uh, juniors so as you told me in the initial the initial part that how, whatever the sub specialties in uh, preventive medicine the uh, student can think about it yes this program is especially for them to think about it so to go with the uh, ideas which you have given the ideas should become a money then only he can uh, run his day to day activity if he is Absolutely. unmarried okay if he is not married he needs if he is married he needs money so other than the faculty can you give a exact data what is the real scenario about the need for faculties in a private sector balaji sir yes sir. so in uh, tamil nadu as well as in tamil nadu so before going into the need for or the uh, what is the exact uh, position in private college and in government college especially in medical colleges like uh, faculty position i would like to rephrase the word instead of calling our subject or community medicine or any other from anatomy to other subjects instead of calling uh, using the word non clinical better to use the word para clinical or community medicine now it has been included in clinical subject this is the thing first i want to emphasize and let us come to the topic straight away uh, yes faculty demand faculty position in medical colleges as definitely the demand in the faculty in medical colleges has been little little gone down see this is actually fluctuating right so it was so much a huge demand was there some 10 15 years back especially in community medicine pre and para clinical subjects but currently just 3 4 years back the situation was little different but now currently as there was a boom in increase in number of private medical colleges everywhere first point and also in government sector also tamil nadu especially in tamil nadu as we are planning for every district we are going to have a government medical colleges so uh, the demand or the important aspect of being a faculty or uh, assistant professor joining in a medical college still the demand is there so let us not focus only about government sector private sector we have every 2 to 3 years we are having at least one or two medical colleges and each medical college in community medicine department we need at least for undergraduate 100 seats or 150 seats we need at least 6 mds 6 mds in the sense one professor to associate professor and minimum 4 to 6 assistant professors are needed so i don't think there will be a uh, see demand is gone or little bit reduced but it is not like others usually usually say that no 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 there is no chance of getting a faculty position in private medical college nowadays the competition is very heavy it is not actually the scenario currently it was there just 2 3 years before you just imagine just found and find go and find out in google so many private medical colleges and deemed universities they have started it's actually a good move from the central government and also from the state government very uh, increasing in number of private medical colleges it's actually the demand is going to be there and it is going to increase in another 2 to 3 years see anticipating next 2 to 3 years we cannot anticipate the faculty position demand in government and private private medical college especially in next 10 years but for my knowledge there will be a demand for next 2 to 3 years at least i can say at least for 5 years so apart from professor apart from faculty what else can be done so sir i think anton sir uh, uh, i think i have answered your question for especially on demand yes yes yes, yes. yes go ahead to finally to finalize the uh, question in one sentence or answer in one sentence yes demand is there in private sector it will be there for next 2 to 3 years but it cannot be answered to anticipate for next 10 years okay fine sir okay. shall we move on to any other yes, uh, discussions sir yes sir uh, so uh, regarding the plan b act what a preventive medicine other than the faculty job can do either in a government or private can go ahead with a uh, enlighten his uh, packet that's Absolutely. also important 
ஒரு <laughs> programs almost demand is huge in national health programs where mp committee medicine is a major eligibility criteria only thing is uh, our faculty or our students are not aware till now i can see that many youngsters those who are joining they are not aware today also while uh, talking to one of my faculties they were telling that sir i don't even know whether the program manager or the program faculty position is available right so program manager national programs is definitely available and you can also be a consultant in various international agencies agencies right so all people coming to medicine and who who see not only the who of course who is offering lot of international uh, uh, health uh, uh, post but in addition to who there are lot of other uh, international health agencies like unicef they are all offering consultant post consultant post or health program managers in international health agencies right and also in addition to uh, this uh, international health agencies NGOs, international non-governmental organizations are also there where you will be getting a research consultant or part-time consultant, not necessarily to be a research consultant alone. You can be a consultant for a program, designing a program, implementing a program. So you can be as a policy maker, policy de- decision maker at the top level or you can start your uh, career with the medium level and then you can go to the top level also. And next important thing is SMOs. SMOs, as all of you are aware, surveillance medical officer post. many places till now you can, you can go and find out in our ministry of health and family welfare website you can find out lot of vacancies are available for surveillance medical officers not necessarily in abroad it is available in our country also so only thing is we should actually uh, have that uh, idea of traveling and good communication skills and you should definitely learn certain administrative skills which are very much needed for joining in this course right so plan b as itself as, as i have told you it is not plan b plan b c d e f g i can say that first one is program manager up to is that it is available so happy Absolutely. yeah no, we have knowledge sir we have that's not what, that, that's what a, a young young uh, preventive medicine uh, aspirant needed or a, a pg aspirant who wants to pursue uh, preventive medicine or any uh, right word para clinical or pre clinical uh they want to know my dear uh, friend balaji because uh, many time we have seen people after joining um, pre clinical and para clinical subjects sending a message sir whether how how it will be sir how i will manage so this uh, uh, chain of programs i have planned for from anatomy to urology the u a for anatomy u for is urology all uh, specialties pre clinical para clinical clinical specialty super specialty sub specialty everything is planned in this program because a person has a knows about a plan b as you say plan c plan d then they can work accordingly because many time um, students want to learn park park yeah park they learn and they park somewhere they they uh, again read the park and they park somewhere they don't go outside the box So, so that's, as you rightly that, said, they see, have to learn the uh, administrative skills. Yes, sir. Absolutely. Go ahead, Balaji, sir. Actually, to say, uh, we have uh, during the uh, training programs of three years of master degree in medical community medicine, we have training programs and competencies in developing all these skills, right? But most of our undergraduate undergraduates after finishing MBBS when they join in community medicine itself, they feel like okay. If we just go on Haram say sit sit uh, sit down or sit in some medical college and then take some classes and then settle down. See, after you go under that, and finally one fine morning they will think that what is this? I don't have any other place to go because you have not searched for it, right? Let me just start with uh, FGH consultant. Consultant are scientists in various research organizations in India. Let us talk about the abroad opportunities later on. so you can be a consultant or you can start with scientist you can start with scientist a b c d e and then go up to the cadre of scientist g which is available in our icmr so icmr and that is as you all know that is our government uh, icmr is uh, our government uh, body and 
you all know you, you may not be knowing a lot of other private research organizations are also functioning including pharmaceutical companies you have a very big opening in pharmaceutical companies we will be thinking pharmaceutical company na ad md pharmacology padcha mattum da kadikum yaar sonna no it's never been like that md community medicine you have if you have a very good data interpretation and analysis skills you can very well work as a research designer or consultant post or a scientist post either in research organizations in pharmaceutical companies start from junior scientist to senior scientist at icmr also and in addition to it you can also if you want to be a good clinician you can very well practice i am practicing as dr anton was telling i have been practicing from 2002 when i came to chennai 18 years i am practicing in spite of my in irrespective of my any specialty i would have definitely practiced my general medicine right so good community physician you can be a very good clinician with some value added course also see how will you develop yourself during your post graduation course that is very important that is very important see md community medicine as dr anton was said part ko mattume padichu a research organization join on more events not possible right so it's not possible so when you, during your md course you have to search for some value added courses as a distant education course which i will be telling in further discussion because we have a huge list of uh, value added course which whichever you feel like which is giving you much interest say for example you want to work in a factory as a occupational safety officer or industrial consultant so you should be able to do a industrial hygiene diploma either post post graduate industry industrial hygiene or occupation safety or occupational medicine which you can do it as a distant education course also during your post graduation so likewise we have lot of other value added courses suppose exactly sir apologies sir have... sorry for yes. interference uh, yes, as you said icmr uh, uh, please mention the website so that uh, rather than uh, uh, ending uh, at the end the students to rather than knowing it when we every time when we utter the talk when we utter the website also it will get into their brain because uh, I, that's how I our website links everything with me i'll be telling you the websites for each and every job opportunities right so because it is initial part of discussion i just want to tell them that these opportunities are these these headings are there see these headings scientists nobody will think that i am an mp community medicine specialist now i am a scientist post to apply for no eligibility criteria itself is an mph or mp community medicine so mp community medicine eligibility criteria you path and path than theriy you will be you are eligible for applying for the job itself many of our faculty many of our mp community medicine specialists they don't even know that so that's why i just want to tell them that you have to have this idea of applying first of all so mp community medicine itself is enough to join as a junior scientist in icmr so go to the icmr website i will be telling you the icmr website as as the dr anton was asking me so i will be uh, telling the icmr.nic.in and ulla poninga na if you enter into the website icmr nic.nic.in that is the main web page website so where you can enter into the career opportunities career opportunity direct link here is when you click up the career opportunity link huge list of vacancy posts are available where application is available in the pdf link where you can click click up click the pdf link where you can find out what is the eligibility criteria how many years of experience what is the salary when is the interview most of these things are walk in interviews so it is available in icmr.nic.in website where you can enter directly and you can easily find out and this is one icmr job related thing and another important thing is mohfw as, as you all know mohfw is the ministry of health and family welfare dot gov dot in all you need to go there vacancy archives no link there is vacancy archives there is a huge list as i was telling you about icmr similarly there is a vacancy archives available it is for almost all the specialists all the specialists means in not, not only for medicos also for non medicos so you should have that konja porumaya ukkanda namakku position ku nama job enna interest irukko you can just see all the applications go to all the applications think about yourself whether you are eligible for that you just apply it go for it and many of the aduthu mukhyamana barrier na theriyuma most of our uh, md psc uh, specialist people they think that see i may not be getting the job as a research consultant why should i apply for this job no you make a try you apply for it you you train yourself and you publish yourself 
during your md pg uh, post graduate itself if you have the habit of publication of at least 3 to 5 publications that itself is more than enough to join or enter as a junior scientist in icm or an mo chapter okay sir exactly sir as, as you rightly said uh, even uh, the question i which i want to which i was thinking in my mind is also like uh, uh yeah um con- yeah preventive medicine consultant can become a, uh, as you are a, a editor in a one of the reputed journal uh can they start a, any index journal so that uh, as a team is there any possibility balaji sir absolutely sir it is very 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 much possible but only thing is you have to have a committed team of people around you and you should have you should be having a uh, organization to be registered under that particular organization or a public health organization or not necessarily public health organization, any organization or society that society would link to it that journal will have a very good will, will have a very good uh, visibility first of all because when you start a journal you should have a visibility right so visibility ka ningal nalla name choose pannu and next important thing is collect the complete editorial team or nalla editorial team ninga select pannu then after the editorial team you have to create a panel of reviewers from national and international levels so th- these are all preliminary steps right for two three people or committed people in the day you can start a journal or even a not not necessarily a journal you can also start a research organization you can also start a for small level or putty level or register panni uh, you can start your own research organization where you can help our uh, faculties uh, sorry pgs those who are doing thesis அவங்க ஹெல்ப் பண்றவங்க சின்ன ஆர்கனைசேஷன் நாட் நெசசரி சி அப்படி ஆரம்பிச்சு தான் சார் ஒரு பெரிய கம்பெனியா போக முடியும் தௌசண்ட் கோர் கம்பெனி ஒரு ஹண்ட்ரட் கோர் கம்பெனி எடுத்தவங்க ஒரு பெரிய ஜேர்னலோ ஒரு ஆர்கனைசேஷன் முன்னாடி பாலாஜி சார் ஐ ஆல்வேஸ் ஐ ஆல்வேஸ் செல் ஒன் வேர்ட் டோன்ட் சர்ச் ஃபார் அ பாத் ரேதர் தென் கிரியேட் ஏ பாத் ஓகே தட்ஸ் அட்ஸ் அ வேர்ட் அஸ் ஃபார் மீ வென் the concept uh, idea came into my mind rather That's than giving a <laughs> now <laughs> to start a concept at vilupuram everyone it was uh, like uh, everyone was thinking small place you are going to start a uh, coaching center see that, that become a brand now it has, now it is uh, uh, in uh, all india level even including delhi so uh, that's how uh, anybody the passion uh, that's a word i always tell money is a by product if you work for a person you become a um, worker i will tell if you create a path you are a boss you are a owner you are a future corporate okay so it so all when, different, I started, driven... when i started my first publication nobody will uh, believe that i have written an article for one and a half years i have written only one journal of my article my thesis oh, one and a half years for writing the article for getting it published it took almost another one year so my first article in pubmed my first article my thesis article was published in pubmed it took almost two to two and a half years but from that time onwards another span of eight years la i crossed more than 100 publications chancellor sir chancellor sir even i can tell another point in this uh, many uh, clinicians and uh, uh, surgeons they don't have an idea about the statistics they don't know exactly even our bailey and love openly accepts it none of the surgeon know to do imrad even the biostats is becoming a first time chapter in bailey and love for surgeons okay so as a post graduate a post graduate can catch 10 20 surgeon surgeons contact get their content do a do publish in your journal you create a journal publish in your journal or help them to publish in the journal where they want like this this growth can happen the plan b idea is not going to become a money immediately please understand my dear friends so you can say that with many of my friends those who are uh, working my juniors uh, they have started their own uh, small research agencies i cannot say the big research organizations so they have started their own uh, small uh, registered agencies so through them uh, through that agency some three four medical uh, community medicine uh, special specialist they join hands together and they are working on and uh, for publication helping the clinical site faculty and uh, and you know for promotions nowadays in private in private medical college you need at least two to three publications to become assistant or associate and associate professor because mc has made it mandatory so these research agencies will in long run definitely will give you a very good returns 
but initially over 2 to 3 years there will be a struggle of course that will be there in uh, any of the fields so they have, they have to work with the passion as you said sir um there are as you rightly said so much uh, uh, job opportunities availability in india but always <coughs> going abroad is a lucrative for any any person only the fear factors will be there whether i will go and shine whether my communication will be good when i go outside the country whether i will be safe when i go outside the country i am a girl whether i will it will be safe for me to go and practice at uk or australia uh, or how uh, difficult it is whether i have to spend money for uh, cracking the exam what are your ideas sir so this abroad, abroad category and i am dividing into two things sir one whether you are opting for job or you are planning to go for a higher studies so two things right so first category md commitment mesh mudichaachu sir enala inimella padikka mudiyadhu enough is enough i just want to utilize this md commitment specialist speciality uh, for uh, earning abin abroad la ninga plan pannala first thing is this md community medicine is not directly being recognized by many of our, uh, many of our abroad universities us uk and also other uh, australian countries now uh, direct md community medicine is not the case right so as we last week there was a discussion about plan uh, sorry plab uh, discussions so plab is definitely needed for writing into entering and also us ml is also needed to but for md community medicine direct qualification which it is for abroad uh, it will be little difficult but another way of approach uh, going for a job for job opportunities in abroad is doing an mb mph in epidemiology or phd phd in epidemiology in addition to md community medicine that will be much much uh, see of course phd md mulchu or phd and nadakku bodhu konja tappa da irukum but as you all everybody knows phds are recognized throughout the world so inga ne md pannum bodhe or md final year pannum bodhe even if you can register the phd any of your phd phd not necessarily in epidemiology okay right and idu or phd register pannittu by the time நீ எம்டி முடிச்சிட்டு ஒரு டூ டூ அண்ட் ஆஃப் இயர்ஸ்ல தீசிஸ் டிஸ்கஷன் முடிஞ்ச உடனே வித் அ பிஹெச்டி தட் வில் பி வெரி 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 குட் ஓபனிங் ஃபார் ஜாப் ஆப்பர்ச்சுனிட்டிஸ் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் ஆப்பர்ச்சுனிட்டி வில் பி லைக் ஆஸ் யூ ஆல் நோ யுஏஇ அண்ட் சவுதி அரேபியா அங்கெல்லாம் வந்து பார்த்தீங்கன்னா எம்டி கம்யூனிட்டி மெடிசன் இஸ் எனப் ஃபார் ஜாயினிங் ஆஸ் அ டீச்சிங் ஃபேக்கல்டி சோ இஃப் யூ வாண்ட் டு பி டீச்சிங் ஃபேக்கல்டி வை டு யூ வாண்ட் டு கோ டு அப்ராட் ஐ டோன்ட் ஐ டோன்ட் एक्चुअली ரெக்கமெண்ட் தட் एक्चुअली ஐ पर्सनலி but some many faculties they think that if they feel like the demand has gone down in india you can also go as a teaching faculty that is mostly available in uae and saudi arabia countries but apart from those countries as far as my knowledge is concerned you have to write lab and usml exam and other australian exams to enter into uh, in addition to md community right this is one aspect right then higher studies higher studies aspiration all of them innum irukanga sir i daily appreciate many people do phd at the age of 40 plus 45 plus i have seen many people and so i am also thinking of registering in phd in epidemiology in our uh, university right so many of our people they don't even know that phds are available in our countries namma country la tamil nadu mgr medical university la many recognized world class universities are there in our country so we can register phds in our country abbi illa enak abroad la pananum na straight away you can register yourself in oxford university and boston university stanford university where they provide uh, phd qualifications directly this is regarding phd in addition to phd higher studies la adutha mukhyamana oru one year sir phd nalla 2 to 3 years panna mudiya sir na one or two year courses are available in tropical medicine many people don't they, they don't know many people they don't know tropical medicine tropical medicine and international health in or degree irukku one or two years diploma course or the master degrees are also available and everybody knows that masters in public health is also available and that is also available in india ad abroad la poi panandra avasiyam illa mph ni indha kuda panalam but if you are interested in communicable diseases sir or disease prevention la na ponom adha na ullu ponom na or pandemic control la active ah field officer work pannona you have to equip yourself with a value added course especially this tropical medicine and uh international health. that is a very good value added course one year course which is available in uh, oxford is oxford university oxford university website la pone inala theriyum sir one year course na takkan mudichirum but that is actually full time course these are all not part time courses i am not telling about those part time courses yes sir uh, you have uh, given a uh, wonderful idea sir really it will be useful for uh, all uh, dear uh, uh, pg as uh, pg um, uh, pgs in uh, preventive medicine as well as uh, young uh, budding uh, uh, preventive medicine consultants 
sir anything else you want to share with the uh, upcoming uh, or a, a person who is really passionate for a, uh, to take a uh, preventive medicine or uh, who is doing a, a pg in a preventive medicine sir yes sir one thing sir i want to tell them if you are passionate towards preventive medicine or if you are already there in preventive medicine do not get panic okay you have a wider opportunities i absolutely see this is not for this they will interview ga anton kukar nal or net la nal pay paakum kudiya na solla you really have a very wide long very wide way of network of opportunities is available for community medicine with md community medicine alone in india and also abroad but only thing is we have to come out of the barrier that md community medicine murcha practically or medical college mattum da irukka mudiyum ingra barrier idu you have to come out right i just list out the opportunities once again you can join as a program officer in the government side and also in the private sector in ngo you can join as a consultant research organization you can join as a consultant junior scientist or scientist a b c d e na sonna mari cadre la you join pannalam field officer ah join pannalam and also surveillance medical officer you can also join in addition to value added courses edha the pg panna bodhe decent education la pannittu you shine yourself or you equip yourself in those in that particular field so that you can focus your job opportunities in future once you finish your complete course right so what you focus நம்ம லார்ட் கிருஷ்ணா சொல்லுவாரு இல்லையா நீ என்ன வாங்க வேண்டும் என்று நீங்க நினைக்கிறாயோ அதுவாக நீ ஆவாய் ஏன்னா ஒன்லி ஒன் திங் யூ ஹாவ் டு டீப்லி அவர் சப் கான்சியஸ் மைண்ட் ஷுட் பிலீவ் தட் ஐ வாண்ட் டு பிகம் லைக் திஸ் ஸோ யூ ஹாவ் அ வைடர் ஆப்பர்ச்சுனிட்டி இன் எம்டி கம்யூனி மெடிசன் ஐ இன்வைட் ஆல் ஆஃப் யூ டு ஜாயின் இன் கம்யூனி மெடிசன் தேங்க் யூ ஃபார் திஸ் ஆப்பர்ச்சுனிட்டி டாக்டர் ஆண்டன் எனி திங் எல்ஸ் தேங்க் யூ சார் ஐ ஆட் ஒன் பாயிண்ட் லைக் டு டூ அ எம்பிஏ டியூரிங் எம்டி ஜெனரல் மெடிசன் or md preventive medicine or anything who has interest in administration is a good thing many distant education courses are available in anna university and various university mba in hospital administration uh, dr rajshree doctor has asked uh, what is the role of uh, uh, administration yes definitely learn a mba in hospital administration you can finish your preventive medicine and you can uh, these are the new jobs you can create actually because rather than uh, uh, this all the passion driven to become a administrator in a hospital it is not a easy job you have to man you have to manage a sweeper to top consultant top surgeon really you have to ad- love the administration okay so uh, take the administrative role during your uh, uh, pg days or any undergraduate students are there always take administrative role because that will that is a real value added living experience that's that you no need to go for mba at oxford university or any universities you yes. become a representative you know what are the pains what are the backstabbing happen what are the how the people talks behind you you become a leader you become a secretary you become a uh, um, like a active person in a strike you will learn a lot of things that is a real value added uh, uh, knowledge okay so you become a non paraclinical consultant any consultant you become a you take a mba administration hospital administration MBA definitely you can apply for a job in a uh, absolutely yes sir mba hospital administration and also mp mba hospital management all these courses are available as you said they can complete this course during their post graduation itself yes, as a yes, as a part time course as a distance education so you can practice in the same tier 1 city as a can as a hospital administration definitely a hospital will take you because you are going to play a multiple role think about it my dear friend think outside the box plan b plan c plan d is always a rule don't stick to one um, need and focus one thing and go behind that okay life is be- be- beyond what you think explore the world tamil la sonna correctana vaartha திரைக்கடல் கடந்து திரவியம் தேடு சரியா சும்மா கிடைக்காது சும்மா எடுத்து கையில கொடுக்க மாட்டான் யாரும் இப்படிதான் பிரிப்பேர்ட் சோ மச் ஆர் கோயிங் டு சீ for life long this is all the um, this is all the words even after our la- last breath it will be there after hundreds of years this will be available for a 
uh, upcoming uh, any time upcoming uh, preventive medicine specialist thanks a lot and thanks for your wonderful time uh, dr balaji thank thanks you, for your valuable time. as a conclusion point one i'll just take one more minute i'll just take one yes, more sir. minute i need to say in the last 10 to 12 years of my uh, academic career as a faculty i have uh, guided a lot of faculty who joined as a budding doctors Guided them, and now they are working in various places. So that is actually a great, actually a great thing. Actually, so one of our our faculty joined in PhD. Some of our program managers, sir, National Herbal Health Mission, our program manager, having qualification as MD Community Medicine, and MD Community yeah, Medicine currently yeah. working in Kerala, la, our junior faculty, my junior faculty. I am very happy to say that I have guided them to go and join in this place, Surveillance Medical Officer in Kerala, Kerala. now currently working in covid 19 so i have so much of examples i have one or, one or two juniors those who joined in as community medicine faculty now they started the research agency they are having lot of uh, uh, initially they started the two three research uh, works now they don't have time to they need not more people for working right so chanceless sir chanceless yeah. that's what so, yeah, wanted i just want to say thank you so much for the opportunity uh, dr anton i'm so happy for thank you. thank you sir uh, i request you to be a part of plan b uh, learning in a facebook page and uh, uh, which is guiding uh, students and uh, uh, you can uh, put your uh, feedbacks and blog, you can write a blog in our website also thank thanks a lot uh, dear uh, viewers and the students please follow our uh, facebook page plan b learning and definitely that plan b learning is for you to earn ultimately but earning is a by product learning is a passion i end this with this thanks a lot for all of you thank you very much my dear friend Professor Dr. Balaji, Jai Hind. Bye bye. Bye sir.